Hello, what is up guys? This is Kyle from Kyle's Game Room, and I am pretty much going to be a copycat, and I apologize, but I really do want to do this. Uh, I'm, I'm going to be doing a new playthrough of uh, Sonic Lost World. However, I'm going to be uh, Super Sonic throughout the whole thing. Uh, and I know you're probably saying, oh, Kabana Money 456 did it, and yeah, I know he did, and I know I, f I feel kind of bad copying him. But, now that I can, I, can, I know that I can record in 1080p, and I know how to make the color look a lot better, and plus my skills have massively improved compared to my original LP of Sonic Lost World, and since I went through the effort in like, like the past couple of days trying to unlock Super Sonic, it was a massive, massive pain. And, oh, that Yoshi looked really cool. But anyway, it was so, so worth it. And I'm happy that I actually did. Like, is it worth getting all those for Supersonic? Like, doing it by yourself, probably not. But I actually looked up, like, how to find all of them. So it wasn't too bad. And again, that looks pretty cool as well. Man, this is freaking more Wara Plaza. This is so dope. But I'm rambling. Let's hop into Sonic Lost World. Yeah, this game, uh, it gets a lot of mixed reviews. Um, I think, uh, like, usually when I'm, I'm finished with the playthrough, during the credits, I will say, what do I think about this game? Uh, this game is okay, like, it's like, it has that Sonic Riders feel to it, like, where, but not that it plays the same, it's just that, like, when you play it for the first time, you're probably not gonna like it that much because of it's a new play style and it has a learning curve, a bad learning curve to it. But, uh, once you do learn it, it's not that bad. And I got the, uh, Knights DLC, like the Nightmare DLC, and the, uh, Yoshi's Island DLC. And I already did levels, like, I already did, like, videos of those. So, you can look them up on my play, on, like, on my channel. Uh, they're probably gonna be in the same, uh, playlist. But, yeah, as you can tell, like, I have all the medals and stuff. And, uh, hold on. You go to the Chaos Emeralds, you can see I already have all seven. Again, it was a big pain. Like, I was, like, seriously swearing. I was like, oh, my God, why can't I do this? And it's very, very stressful to get all of them. But I did, and I got them, and I'm really happy. So we're going to play. So what you got to do is get 50 rings. And when you get 50 rings, you can play a Super Sonic. And what's really cool is here, like, you know how in this game they got rid of the uh, boost to win type of deal where it was, like, how, like, how Sonic Rush, uh, Sonic, um... What all Sonic Generations, Sonic Unleashed, like how they all like just made you press that button and you would boost throughout the whole game. Uh, yeah, they got rid of that, and uh, some people didn't like it because they liked boosting the win, and some people didn't like boosting the win because um, I don't know, they just thought it was too easy. I guess I don't know. So yeah, when you unlock Super Sonic, you get that back. So it's kind of a way of saying, okay, if, okay, if you like this playstyle again. Well, if you beat the game and you get all the if you get all the red medals, you get all the chaos. Uh, yeah, you automatically unlock all the chaos emeralds. Uh, then, bam, you get yourself a supersonic. And it looks like we have enough rings. We have 68 rings, so we can start being supersonic now. Okay, like it's not like when you uh, get all of them, you automatically unlock all of them. Like if you get all of them in an area, like if you get you get all the red medals for uh, Windy Hill. You all the, then you get a chaos emerald, all right? You don't have to do a special zone or anything. It's already there for you. Holy crap! We almost died. Okay, yeah. Let me show you the uh, boost feature. Anyway, uh, Sonic speed is increased a little bit, and his uh like the way how his spines are like when he's like doing parkour and stuff and climbing the walls, like, doing like pretty much doing parkour stuff. I'm not really happy with that. Like especially like that. It looks ugly. But yeah, and if you look up videos and pictures, you will see that Supersonic does have two mouths. <laughs> Why they did that, I have no idea. Well, see, look, parkour. See, look, it still looks normal. And when you finish a level, you revert back to regular Sonic. So, I don't know how many zones I'm going to do. Per, like, like, I don't know how many levels I'm going to do per part. I'm not sure if I should do the whole Windy Hill or just do half of it. I don't know.
We'll see what happens. Okay, um, now let's move on to Act 2. Uh, but since we're moving kind of fast, I'll probably do the whole world. Okay, now we're doing uh, 2D. Okay. Uh, this is actually going to be the first time I do 2D as uh, like Supersonic. Like, at least in Sonic Lost World. I got Supersonic in, uh, what's it? The uh, Sonic, uh, Sonic 4 Episode 2. I still need to unlock him in Sonic 4 Episode 1. It's just the... Uh, the last bonus stage is so hard. Okay, how many rings? Okay, we lost all our rings! Yay! So, will we be supersonic <laughs> in this level at all? I sure freaking hope so. There we go! We lose even more rings. Go me. Come on, Sonic. There we go. Come on. Yeah, I remember I, when I did the playthrough, I only did 720p because I wanted a better frame rate. However, I think YouTube uh, downgrade downgrade your videos to uh, 30 frames a second if you have a 60 frame per second video. But I think there is a way to actually watch a video on YouTube to make it 60 frames a second. I just don't know how to do it. Okay. Just a few more rings. As long as we don't get hit, we should be okay. Let's go up here. Okay. <gasps> there we go. And there is one issue I do not like about uh, Supersonic is that he's not completely invincible. Like there's like uh mine carts at the end of the game, like toward the end of the game, like it was uh what was it? Uh Lava Mountain or something. Uh Act 2 or Zone 2. Let me kill you real quick. Kill you real quick. You were lucky this time. So there we go. There's zone two done. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I'm gonna do like each world per part. Um, I don't know how often I'm going to upload this. I'm going to try to do it as a daily process, but I don't know. We'll see what happens. Um, all right, so next, let's move on to Zone 3. Oh, and uh, here, then I can show you how Supersonic has two mouths. Yeah, it's kind of awkward looking, but what really makes me upset about it is... They didn't pack... Like, here, they, they made patches for this game to fix the, uh... Like the no lives being gained through like through levels or whatever, like, and that really made me upset about this game, and that upset a lot of reviewers with this game too. Like, like that's a standard for platformers. If you get a hundred of an easily acquired item, whether it be coins, rings, wampa fruits, whatever, uh, you should get an extra life. And Sonic's been doing it for quite some time, so why he just suddenly stopped doing it, I have no freaking idea. Alright, so now we have enough, so, Super Sonic time, woo! Uh, unfortunately, I don't really like being Super Sonic that much in this level, because how the camera is right behind Super Sonic, and unfortunately, uh, the way that the camera is set up, like, and how his boost is set up, uh, like, there's like a big stream behind him, and it's just ugly. And... Like not that, like, like not fully because it's ugly, but like it usually hogs up the camera and you can't really see where you're going. Like right now, like it pretty much sounds like I'm talking out of my butt. But later in the level, you will completely understand what I'm talking about. And yeah, he also has a uh, tendency to not slow down. <laughs> like when you want him to stop. Hold on, I want to show you more of my parkour skills. Down there. So yeah, my parkour skill has proper like has surprisingly increased. However, it's still not the best. But it's a lot better than from when I started. Anyway, yeah, I only did 720p to do 60 frames a second, but YouTube downscales it. Like see like right now, like the way that the camera is set up is just not good for me. Like, for all I know, there could be like a part. But what the heck? What the heck? 
There could be a part where there's going to be a cliff, and I'm just going to completely fall down it, and that's not good. But luckily there isn't. So we're going to do it down here. Now, the way to show off the two mouths is to go toward this end. See there, look, two mouths! <laughs> Why? Like, you had multiple patches. Freaking uh, Sonic Lost World, Sega Team, Sonic Team, I mean. Sega and Sonic Team, Sega Team. You had multiple patches. Why didn't you fix that? And there's already videos on the internet saying how that was there. <sighs> I don't know. But I'm happy that they fixed that once you get 100 rings, you do get lives again. And I remember I made an issue saying, oh, once you do this level, it's a once and done deal. It's gone forever. But again, they patched that up so that is no longer the case. I think you get like 100,000 points and it comes back. Okay, we just did this level. So now we're going to do Act 4. Well, Zone 4. Whatever. Alright, so let's do this. Uh, I did play with Supersonic a little bit in uh, a couple of levels, but not all of them. So, when it comes to Supersonic, it's blind. <laughs> yeah, like, like for the first couple of zones, uh, everything was actually blind. Like, when it comes to like trying to find the red rings and stuff. But, it got annoying real fast, because I would always get lost. I'm like, okay. Like, I would, like, really, really take my time and examine every level, and it would be, like, 20 minutes at a time. It was ridiculous. And that's, like, not including the deaths that I would experience. So, I ended up looking up a playthrough on, like, how to get all of them. And it really, really helped out. So, um, I think the channel name was called, uh, The Real Sonic Fan. So, if you need some help, check it, check out his uh, channel. It's good. <laughs> it really helped me out. As soon as we go into this next part, we're going to go into Supersonic. So, that's fun. Um, unfortunately, his quality that I've seen... Like, I was watching it through my gamepad, so it's probably why the quality was bad. But also, uh, this also happened to uh, Sonic's channel. Uh, the... Uh, the gameplay, like, the quality of the video itself was really, really bad. Like, there was, like, a lot of shadowing. Like, I don't know why that happened to both of those guys. So, I don't know. Something happened. And it's, it's really a shame. Boost the win! Boost the win! Boost the win! Even though we weren't really boosting that much. Holy crap, that was actually kind of close. Um, let's see, hold on. Freaking, uh, Supersonic and Sonic Generations? God! He is really powerful! <laughs> he can freaking play through a freaking level, like, super duper fast. Like, once I do a playthrough of, uh, Sonic Generations, I will do a playthrough of, uh, Supersonic. Uh, like, like, as a playthrough. Again, copying Kabana Money 456. But if you guys want to see it, then I'm gonna do it. Whee! But Supersonic in Sonic Generations, he really eats up his rings. It's ridiculous how much he eats it up. It's like, sweet lord, Sonic. Freaking slow down. <laughs> Freaking Zaz freaking actually speeds up since I'm supersonic and he needs to catch up to me. I hate how the Chaos Emeralds weren't really implemented into the story that much. Like, I mean, by much I mean, like, at all. Like, they didn't even talk about them or anything. Then, then again, they did the same thing for uh, Sonic Colors. It's still whatever. I love being Sonic Colors. I, mean, I mean, I like being supersonic in Sonic Colors because then, like, uh, it played the Reach for the Stars music. And what the heck, two of those things? Yeah, just reach for the stars as a freaking song for Supersonic was excellent. Because I love that song so much. This song, eh, I don't know. It's okay, I guess. Why it's taking this boss so long to kill, I have no idea. But whatever. There we go. So yeah. Since I already have everything unlocked, I got all the levels unlocked, all the red medals, I was good to go. So, 
re-going through this game as Supersonic is going to be a lot faster. So, there you go, guys. That was uh, part one for our Supersonic playthrough of Sonic Lost World. So, if you like what you saw, be sure to like, comment, favorite, and subscribe. And tune in next time for some more Supersonic Lost World. So, yeah, I guess I'll see you guys next video.